So did he win? Of course he won, weren't you there? No. But you heard about it, right? Uh-uh. Heard about what, dude? Pete Flanagan and Scott Sherman? Uh, the day that changed our lives forever, man. <laughs> All right, so it was sophomore year and Pete and Scott were just about to fight. Hold on, why did Pete want to fight Scott? Apparently, Scott sold Pete's little sister a bag of oregano. So Scott was getting his ass kicked, and Scott, being the pussy that he is, curled up in a ball so Pete really couldn't hit him. And then for some reason, Pete thought it would be a good idea to pull his pants down, spread his cheeks, and then spit in his ass crack. That might be the most fucked up thing I've ever heard. Why do you think Pete changed schools? All right, Danny said to meet him at the park. Which park? The one where Pete spit in Scott's ass crack. My grandma probably only shits like two or three times a month, if that. Let's say, for the sake of the argument, she shits four times a week. Mm. Can I eat some with some bread or onions? No, that'd be too easy. I picture her, like, squatting over your wide open mouth. Alright, so we're talking 16 shits for three months each. That's 48 shits total. Not to mention that it's straight from the tap, no bread or onions. Or go to jail for 10 years. I'm still gonna eat that shit. I am not going to prison. I'm doing the 10 years I'd learn more than there than I would in college. Yeah, might come out with a good old eight pack. Yeah, come out with the eight pack of hard dick. All right, give me the cash. Come on, Joshy. Mm -hmm. I ain't smoking. What? Why not? Going on a cleanse. But you smoked not two hours ago. That was then. This is right now. All right. Didn't want to ruin the surprise, but you guys left me no choice. Have you guys ever heard of a weed called George W. Cush? Of course I've heard of George W. Cush. Weed Feed Magazine rated at 420 for a total score of 420. Danny has some. You guys don't want to miss out. After today, my cleanse officially begins. Boys, finally getting ahead in life. Man, I gotta quit jerking off so much. Mom, catch you again? No, thank God. Um, I just keep getting these sharp pains, like, right in my nose. Nah, dude, that's an occupational hazard. Coconut water, lotion, clear that right on up. Coconut water? Yep, hydrates the nuts. Yo, what up, bro? You're the dude hitting me up for the snake venom, right? What? Is that even real? Collected in my soap. What do you use it for? Tastes good on chicken lo mein. So what can I get you? You got any of that George W. Kush? Who told you that? You did, man. I ran out of that hours ago. Dude, I've been hitting you up for like two hours. I do have some K2, but don't smoke too much of it, because it can lead to sudden loss of vision and hearing. No thanks, man. Anything else would be a disappointment. Yo, B, hold up. What up? Come here. I feel bad about running out of that GWK, but the same dude who sold me that GWK also gave me a small badge of some other shit. Got any left? Yeah, I have some left. How much? I do have to warn you about something. What? I sold this particular strain to three other dudes, and almost instantly after I sold to them, they got arrested for some really crazy shit. And mind you, they were some real stand-up type of guys. What are you trying to say? Well, I did some research, and in some circles, they believe this type of strain to be cursed. And whoever smokes it will have 86 years of bad luck. Have you smoked any of it? Almost all of it. Then why haven't you been arrested? You know, that's a question I often ponder about myself. To tell you the truth, 
I was about to come out here and bury this weed in the ground so no one had to carry the curse. Dude, I'd be more than happy to take it off your hands. Alright, hold on. Bro, that's like a 10 sack. Trust me, it's more than enough. It's better than nothing. How much you say it was? Twenty dollars. Thanks, man. What's it called again? The Great Bambino. <laughs> If you want a preview, I got some rolled up. I'll take a few hits. So what those guys get arrested for? The first dude got arrested for child porn. Then I sold some to Scootsy, who got arrested for skipping child support payments. Then the last guy got arrested for stealing a shopping cart and child porn. <laughs> you think the curse is real? Nah, I'm probably just tweaking. Oi, it's a Bobby! Hey! Um, excuse me, mister, but can you please turn down the lights? I don't really like all There's no way. And this shit just don't feel right. And I really want to be rude to Yo, let's get out of here. Yo, what the frick were you running from? Nothing, uh, we need somewhere to smoke, don't we? Mmm, just hit up Bailey. No, he's out of town. Damn, that sticks a sharp ass thorn in my thigh. There's nowhere else we can go besides his house to just sit back, chill, get high, and not worry about getting caught, you know? You know what we should do? We should just sneak into his house and smoke without him even there. Hmm, funny thing is, we probably could get away with it. You know, that's not too bad of an idea. Nah, seriously though, where are we gonna go? Now think of it, we could hop the fence, smoke in his backyard, we'll be in and out in 10 minutes. And people see us there all the time, they'll probably think we're just house-sitting or something. I guess we've done stupider things. I'm down. Let, let's just go back to the park, you guys. Oh yeah, and just get caught again for the third time. Alright. After 10 minutes, though, I'm out. Let me see that. Bro, that's like a 10 set. Bro, that's more than enough, idiot. I should have said strong to my cleanse. Trust me, it'll be worth it. It's some dank. Holy shit! What happened? Daddy just got caught by the cops. Damn, what'd they get him for? They got his ass for 86 years in prison for trafficking elderly sex slaves. Probably make a good chunk of change though. Can't blame him. Must have happened right after he sold to you, B. Yeah. Guess we got lucky, huh? Wait, don't spark it yet. What the? I really gotta take a shit. You, you, you can't wait 10 minutes? You know I got a bladder deficiency. How many times I gotta tell y'all? What are you gonna do? Wipe your ass with the petunias? Bailey's got a spare key in the grill. I'll be right back. Oh, shit. Man, hurry up, all right? Oh, do you just wipe your ass and not wash your hands? It's not that bad. Do you just hear that?
think I just fell in love with a porn star. Turn the camera on, she a porn star. Turn the corner. Oh shit, this is cousin Haley. What the frick is she doing here, man? I don't know, let's just wait it out. She can't stay here forever, right? Yeah, yeah. No, I got it. I'm gonna creature. Let me tell you about a girl I know. Had a drink about an hour ago. Sitting in the corner by herself. In a bar in downtown. Robbing the place, bro. What's up? No, I didn't eat the last frozen pizza. I don't know, maybe mom made it. No, 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 I, yeah, yes, no. All right, I, I, I love you too. I'm coming home. We gotta call the police. We can't call the police. They'll just try to pin it on us. One thing's for sure. We gotta get the fuck yeah, out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. No! What the fuck are you doing? We might as well steal some shit too. No, dude. No, we gotta go. Yeah. No, sure. Stop. 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 Guys, I uh, hate to say this, but I think she's dead. She's not dead. This happens to my aunt all the time. I bet in 30 minutes she'll be up good as new. I don't know. I've watched a lot of CSI Miami in my day, so I know what a dead body looks like. And that's a fucking dead body. Oh, shit. No fucking way Danny was right. What? Dan was right about what? Nothing! What the fuck's going on here, Brandon? Danny didn't have any GWK, so he sold us some other shit called the Great Bambino. You're not making any fucking sense, dude. He might have mentioned something about the weed being cursed. Cursed? Why didn't you tell us? Because his reasons were purely anecdotal. Wait, you say the weed's called the Great Bambino? Yeah. Have you never heard of the curse of the Bambino? I didn't put two and two together. What? What is the curse of the Great Bambino? Well, you see, in 1918, 
Red Sox traded Babe Ruth to the Yankees, which led to an 86-year World Series drought. Well, is it real? It's real as the nose on your fucking face, buddy. All right, unless you guys want to start taking whole baths in a prison cell, I suggest you pay attention. So you guys find somewhere to put the body, and I'll go check what the neighbors up to. ¿Quiero el patrón criminal de esta casa? Sí, gracias. Where'd she go? Oh, nice job. All right, now make sure we didn't leave any clues that linked to the crime. I don't need one of us getting caught because someone left their wallet from Yeah, good idea. I got my stuff. Yeah, yeah too. Alright, I think the coast is good. Alright, let's go. Wait, hold up, guys. I gotta go blue. No, dude, are you kidding me? Man, he's got a deficiency. I know he got a deficiency, but hurry up, dude. We gotta get out of here, man. Let's go, dude. Come on. Yeah, let's go outside. So, what are you gonna do with the money you get from the jewelry you stole? Um, I was thinking about getting a vest, like a little bow wow. Oh, man, that's smart. That dude's fly. I wish I stole something. Don't take the kick, cause niggas ain't fucking around no more.